hardcore character. I've uh, never actually played a hardcore Diablo 3 character before. The game in general is fairly easy, so I'm not too worried about it. Um, I already started playing a little time uh, sub level 13. Oops, wrong. There we go. Uh, yeah, so we're on the Khazra Denton quest for Act 1 here. I'm generally not going to be talking too much past the intro here. Um, if people show up, I'll converse. If not, um, well, just enjoy the regular gameplay. Uh, for those wondering, I don't have the best of equipment here. Really early. <laughs> Probably gonna go salvage a bunch of this. There we go. Playing on normal here, just so that I can uh, get through the game fairly quickly. I'm working on the trophies for um, killing Diablo and Malthael with a hardcore character, while simultaneously also doing it with a Necromancer, which is one of the uh, DLC trophies. So I figure, why take any chances with the uh, with the trophies here? Because if the character in hardcore, if the character dies, then uh, they're dead for good. You have to restart the whole game. <laughs> or restart the whole character, pretty much. Not just pretty much. You do. <laughs> uh, Skills-wise, let's see. We got bone spikes, death nova. Corpse Explosion, Command Skeletons. The ability we have right now is fueled by death. <laughs> and because this is my first hardcore character ever, I don't have any Paragon levels yet. Then... Oh, waypoint. You said it, Cormac. <laughs> ah, molten. Wonderful. Molten, uh... The molten buff tends to leave fire on the ground, then they explode afterwards.
night embraces you. I do like how they've upgraded corpse explosion now. In two, it only blew up one corpse at a time. Now it's all corpses in an area. <laughs> that being said, the uh, damage, I don't think it's based on enemy hit points anymore. Let me take a look. Oh no, now it's based on weapon damage. Okay. Whereas in 2, it was based off of enemy health, I believe, and um, got really useful in the higher difficulties. Lost mine. That would have been especially useful in this game here, because uh, the higher difficulties, they just scale the enemy health so absurdly. Now it hits the rolling logs. <laughs> That's the only minor problem with the console version over the uh, PC version of Diablo 3. Is that for spellcasters, you can't always aim exactly where you want it. The auto targeting is generally pretty good but there are specific times like right then when I wanted to hit the uh, rolling logs and it's like oh we'll hit the enemies <laughs> Use to you. Okay. Ooh, we got a curse now. Decryptify. Yep. Hmm. That's pretty close to two. Yeah. <laughs> we should have known the farmers left over a fortnight ago, and yet we stayed. Last night. We heard the beasts creeping closer. My husband left to investigate, and I haven't seen him since. All I have left are the things we made together. Hopefully, they are of more use to someone else. All right, we got a passive skill, too. Increase armor. Reduce but Ow. Now mm, yeah, we'll keep this one. These are dark times, my friend. I thought for a moment you were one of those dreadful goat men. Since you're not, would you like to buy something? Ha! <laughs> ah, no thanks. Take the repair job, though. That goes to the old mill. What's this? Oh, good. And then, oh no, that's a uh, channeling shrine. Thought it was an enlightened shrine at first.
<laughs> the rolling logs target perfectly when there's no one there. <laughs> More molten minions. Crap, this curse here. <laughs> oh my. There's a lot more of these bats right here. <laughs> these guys are electrified. <laughs> Now they just weren't standing in front of it. <laughs> there we go. Got one of them. Oh, okay. Kind of expecting that pile of skull bones there to like kind of explode, but it, nothing happened. <laughs> so of course the Cosmer Den is in the middle somewhere. <laughs> of course it is. no real clue as to where this den is. Usually by now they have a, a oh, arrow yeah. marker. <laughs> Probably gonna end up revealing the whole map before I find it. <laughs> I found an event here. Explosion is really handy for this. <laughs> Rathma has blessed me. We got a new skill there. Oh, we got a rune for the mage. Let's see. Hmm.
Oh, nice. That's nice. Uh, follower. Oh, new skill on the follower. Let's see, we got charge. Onslaught. Eh, we'll give him charge. <laughs> and we'll give him this ring too. Okay. We gotta resummon all the skeletons, really. Den's probably up there somewhere. See, now that's a little better. That rock pile exploded, unlike those bones earlier. That just kind of moved a couple centimeters. <laughs> hmm. Go around this way. Yeah, earlier that pile of bones is like one of those parlor tricks where the guy pulls the tablecloth from underneath a bunch of stuff and the stuff's all perfectly fine. Ah, we gotta take out those plague nests. nests. Okay. <laughs> hmm. I am undone. Demon spawn have taken root in my fields. And then you must go. This land is all my family has. I cannot leave. Alrighty. <laughs> then stay here in your contradiction. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Cormac's a little stuck. <laughs> Brilliant bit of pathing there. <laughs> Decay and rot. The terrain in Diablo three is fairly simple, but uh, pathfinding can be fairly complicated depending on how complicated the terrain is. More so than people might think. My land is safe. Bless you. Tristram's families will not starve thanks to the work we have done today. Sounds good. Finally. I must be near a piece of the sword. There we go. Here's the Cosra then. this time. We must hurry with the ritual. Magda will be here soon. It is turning. Prophet of torture. <laughs> Who are you to take what is mine? It belongs to another. Regardless, I have claimed it. I am Magda, and I lead this coven. The shard is mine. Then you have made an enemy. Very well. Let the game... Well fought. 
But you will never possess the next piece. It has fallen where only the ancients may tread. She is more devious than she appears. That's saying something, I guess. That's one thing I've noticed in Diablo 3 is uh, all the villains here, they like to trash talk a lot. Now, I don't know if Blizzard was like trying to attract the Call of Duty crowd or something, but um, usually when you have a villain doing a lot of trash talking and not a lot else, that's usually pretty lazy writing. Personally, it bugs me, but I don't know. People, some people like it. <laughs> All right. Could go back to town. Okay. I recovered a piece of the sword, but members of a coven are pursuing it as well. Uncle Deckard, they sound like those dark cultists you told me about. Very good, Leia. You have been paying attention. Stranger, does any of this jar your memory? I have no memory of this coven, but I sense a far darker shadow guiding its hand. They know where the next piece is. Their leader said it fell where only ancients may tread. That makes me think of the drowned temple near the festering woods. I remember you telling me about it, Uncle. Exactly, Leia. The temple was home to the Nephilim. Leia, your knowledge could be invaluable. You must go and help our friend retrieve the sword piece. The Nephilim were ancient humans with fantastic powers. Legend holds that they waged a terrible battle near the temple, and that their ghosts still war with one another. Alrighty. Crossbow. You know what? I'm going to take that. And we'll give him that one. <laughs> Just the thing. Um, right, okay. Have a little less than 10,000 gold, okay. Right, right, right. Salvage. I have to be level 16 before I can use any of that, so... Eh. Why is the Enchantress up there? Or not the Enchantress, the uh, Mystic. I mean, the jeweler isn't up there. She's not around till Act Five. Hmm. Well, okay, let's max her out. Yeah, not gonna spend any money enchanting right now. You see, in Diablo 2 at this point, I would be browsing the shops and being like, oh hey, is this an upgrade? And then look for stuff to upgrade. But um, the drop rate, the things that drop in the, as you're actually doing the quests, are usually better than what you buy in the shop. There's really no reason to look at the shops. 
another minor thing that kind of bugs me. The thing about Diablo 3 is that it doesn't have any huge obvious flaws, except for their lack of planning in the very beginning. Um, with the servers crashing because millions of people decided to log on at once. <laughs> Um, I think the Decker believes the key to unlocking the but it just has reassembling his like, sword. I wish I could say this was another of, of Uncle's crazy things. theories, but I can't deny that these ominous Wait events for are stop talking to really here. scare me. Yeah, it just has lots of little things, like uh, like the difficulty scaling is more like inflating the enemy health than their act actual how much they hit you and. Um, it's really not clear uh, when it's a, when it's appropriate for you to go up in difficulty, things like that. Like if you're doing okay on Torment 2, um, you want to go up to Torment 3, but there's really no like real obvious marker that says, hey, you're ready for Torment 3, you can bump it up and then all of a sudden find yourself dead. <laughs> Um, just little things like that. <laughs> Gotta go that way. The problems aren't really all that apparent on this difficulty level. Um, like I said earlier, playing on normal just to kind of speed through it, get the uh, trophies. After much searching, I have found a promising lead. A family near New Tristram has obtained a valuable relic and poor fools of it. You there! Please help! They're going to kill my friend! Thieves are going to... Who is this Oops. friend of yours? She's just a farmer's daughter, Sasha, but she has a relic that the thieves are after. Where is the relic? I'll never tell you. Enough of this. Release Sasha and give her the relic. You actually believe what this scoundrel tells you? Fine, you fools. We'll kill the both of you. You won't get away from us this time! over. The rest of the Thieves Guild will find you. Oops. Here's the relic, my love. I hid it like you asked. Father's grown suspicious of us, but that won't matter once we're married. It won't be long, right? Of course, my dear. Soon we will settle down to a quiet life of tilling the fields and raising brats... Uh, children but first <laughs> i have to sell this relic alas i must travel away with my friend here to do so what you mean to accompany me yes yes you look like you know a lot about markets now lead the way You're sure right. relic is a fake you seem like you could use a helping hand and i sure as hell don't want to stay around here Please tell me that you're not considering this criminal's proposal. You don't actually have much of a choice. He kind of tags along anyway. That becomes part of the plot. There you are. But yeah, if I had a choice, I actually would never have let him join at all. Yeah, he's just... And you'll be trolled. All kinds of unethical. Betrothed. Do I look like the marrying kind to you? By the way, my name is Lyndon. Um. Yeah, I'll let him go into. But the tomb say of a in this temple is not encouraging. I haven't really decided what follower to have with the necromancer here. You must be Alaric the Guardian. Uncle Decker told me of your eternal we'll just wait to this act first two. place. I thought it was a myth. Are you Nephilim? No, there have been no Nephilim for a millennium. Yet another myth. 
You seek entrance to this temple, but only a Nephilim can enter. If you retrieve the keys from the outlying tombs and use them on the gates, we will see who and what you truly are. Follow me. I will raise the bridge that you may pass. Seek two tombs in the woods beyond. The warriors rest in the crypt of the ancients. Within them reside the keys to our sacred temple. Sounds good. Deckard called these flying creatures death of wings. Frenzy Shrine, there we go. <laughs> oh, hey, we got one of the dungeons here. All right, Crypt of the Ancients. <laughs> That's frozen. Bone Spear, Bone Spike, and Bone Spirits have a 30% chance to trap enemies. Do I want movement speed? Or traps? I think I'm going to go with traps. Oops. And then Devour. Nah, I think I'd rather have Corpse Explosion than that. Thank you both for your help. I am inspired by our friend here. Thank him. There is no need. Okay, that's one, I guess. I think there's like a uh, journal or something down here. He was so yeah. sure we could beat whatever traps the ancients had laid for two mothers, but the dead bodies of my friends testify to the folly of our arrogance. I will be dead soon as well. Our greed was our downfall. guys down there. Oh well. The Necromancer was the last class I kind of expected to be able to snipe with. <laughs> but yet, here we are, hitting things from a huge distance. Serve 
Oh, good. Here's the other place. Warriors rest. says that our people can survive the coming battle, but I saw the truth in his eyes. Why did he order me to guard the beacon of honor? Those shambling things are slaughtering my people in the forest above, and there's nothing I can do to stop it. Nope. Now this guy show up. Course we get the attack buff after everyone's dead. Sounds like Cormac's voice. Repel them, my brothers. It's almost as if actors play more than one role. <laughs> oh, there's that bone prison they were talking about. That's all of them. Your strength rivals that of our greatest champions. What now do you think you are? You may enter our most sacred place. The spirit speaks the truth. The world stone has been changed. Our children are born weak and suffer short lives. The demon Nereza promised to restore their power, but instead turned them into misshapen creatures and sent them to war against us. We the noble hero fought his way here just to die. You are again mistaken. And who is this you bring with you? Adria's daughter? She has power within her. No matter. Your mother will soon share your fate, little one. The shard is mine. Fill this temple with their blood. What did she mean my mother will share my fate? Could my mother be alive after all these years? She has every reason to deceive us. Do not listen. And what is the power within you that she spoke of? This fight was too easy. She's toying with us. We must get back to Uncle Deckard right away. I need to go back. Let's do that. The second piece is safe, but I do not know where the last one has fallen. I remember a glow streaking towards 
a fishing village. That must be worth them. Ah, brilliant dear Leah. Have the ferryman take you there. <laughs> Deckard sounds like he's just phoning in that line. <laughs> we can't even talk to Kate anymore. That's not ominous. Hmm. Nah. Hmm. Maybe? Nah. We'll keep that for now. Okay, we can use some of it now, so it's worth it to train. Okay. Assuming we wanted to make something. But we only have about 6,000 gold, roughly. To worth them. Right to worth them. I have some new ideas that I've seen. I was thinking. Don't hurt yourself. <laughs> I was thinking that we should try to recruit more soldiers. What happens if we get attacked again? We just spent a week fighting off hundreds of walking corpses outside our impenetrable gates with the hardest bastards within a hundred miles. Who's going to attack us? I seek passage to Wortham. I will take you, but beware. Smoke rises from the village. Destroying the town! Get out while you can! By all that is holy, the town is burning! One of the men retrieved a strange artifact in his nets. It looked like a hilt of an ancient blade, but I know it must be more. The fisherman argued with me, but I convinced him to leave it in the safety of the chapel. A holy place, or a holy relic. Death! To those who defy. Safety of the chapel, eh? Please, <clears throat> if family's hiding in the chapel with the rest of the townsfolk, we must get to them. Don't run off. You'll get yourself killed. Fools! You cannot keep the sword from me! This is bad. My servants will burn this town to ashes! More trash talking. I hear something coming. Prepare for a long sight! That was something that made two really enjoyable, was the fact that the Prime Evils really didn't care about you <laughs> until you were right there. Then they're like, oh, well, I guess you're worthy of my attention. <laughs> so we got a Siphon Blood Rune. Hmm. Nah. Yeah. 
bone spear rune. Oh, teeth. <laughs> nah. Leech. Hmm. Hmm. I'm going to keep Decryptify. There is only one thing I would ask of you. I seek a sword fragment. Have you seen it? We found it days ago. I wish we'd never brought it here. Come, I left Virgil to guard it. We will be glad to be rid of it. I'm going back to Tristram to check on Uncle Deckard. While you were on your hero's errand here, I captured all three sword pieces and your friends. I will put an end to this. It's your choice, Cain. Either use your Herodric arts to repair the sword, or your dear Leah dies a horrible death. All uh, oh, this pain, this destruction. What is the sword to you? To me, nothing. To my master, Belial, everything. Yes! Oh. <laughs> Your rage is overwhelming, girl. You win this round, but if the sword cannot be mine, I'll claim the one it's bound to. In the end, the blade shall be mine. Uncle, you can't die. Nothing can stop that now. But there is one last thing I must do. The sword must be made whole. That was fast. Just <laughs> as I suspected, the sword is of the high heavens. The stranger is an angel. Heed the journal. The truth lies within. Uncle I Deckard! They killed Cain! Those bastards! <laughs> Who am I gonna stay a while and listen to now? If only I could control this power, I could have saved him. I do not know. There were others who were responsible. Magda and her master Belial. The journal speaks of an angel falling from the heavens as the shadow rises from the abyss. The stranger is the key to all of this. So it seems. I will search for him. When my power erupted, I saw into Magda's mind for an instant. She's fled to the highlands. You can reach them through the caves above Wortham. You have to know, she'll be waiting for you. I am prepared for that. Uncle Deckard is gone forever. Remember the wonderful times we had together. Always off on another crazy quest. What will I do without him? He believed the stranger was an angel. But he is only a man. I always knew they were just stories. Uncle Deckard died for those stories. Hmm, let's see here. What's a dagger? Take it. The uh, damage of the skeletons is based off the weapon. Same with the corpse explosion, so.
This will help. Level 21, yeah, we're a ways off. That's not where I thought the portal was leading. <laughs> oh, that's right, there's a waypoint. We took the waypoint back here, back to town, All right? Right. Suddenly. Do not fear the end. sings to me. Her music echoes from beyond. You say so. Yeah, hands heavy for scent and terror. This does not bode well. He wasn't quite on the ground yet. <laughs> or it. Our sect the venomous. I hear a treasure goblin somewhere. Come on, trap him! Yes! Get the bone prison around. Oh, wait, no. There wasn't. He just stopped. Get back here. Got here, frenzied shrine.
think I hear uh, another treasure goblin. I don't know where. Wait. I think I see some glittering. Top left corner of the screen. Yep, there he is. No, nope, come back. <laughs> Get him. There we go. Stuff. <laughs> This place is fairly big. Not as big as some of the Act 5 dungeons, but still pretty big. Hundred enemies, okay. Time to blow things up. <laughs> this world can abide you no longer. There's the 100 mark. Except it me. Come close and feel her loving embrace. Well, that was not going to end well. Please help me. It's horrible. She sucks the innards from her victims. Oh, no. No. It's too late. I hear her. The Spider Queen is coming. Spider Queen? Thing. That is not possible. Come on, guys. Over this way. Towards the corpses. <laughs> That'll work, too. <laughs> No rush, I guess. It was terrible being stuck in there like that. Thank the gods you came along. What are you doing out here? I'm looking for a man who was taken prisoner by the Coven. The Coven? I saw them dragging someone into Leoric's manor house. Perhaps it was the man you seek. Uh, you might have a small bit of trouble reaching there, though. 
I'm not proud of this, but I stole the stuff of a powerful Khazra shaman. The Khazra went mad and chased me to the caves. You can find the stuff in my cart in the highlands. If you take it to the Khazra barricade, perhaps they will let you pass. See, this is a little weird. It implies that there's a bit of diplomacy you can do, but you just kill everything in sight. <laughs> The staff is really just a trigger for opening the gate. These lands once belonged to the crown. At first I thought, oh, choices! We can blast our way through or we can get this staff. No. Man, Golem Rune. Dual sides. Unstable. Ooh. Uh, Death Nova Rune. Each cast increases the radius of your next Nova by five yards up two times. Oh, nice. Though new Tristram and the fields surrounding it have been resettled over the years, the highlands remain empty save for the crumbling ruins of Leoric's old outposts. The king built more than one watchtower in his paranoia, but now they cannot even ward away goatmen and wild beasts. A tragedy, really. <laughs>
Explorers, no quarter! I cannot open this. Yeah. Fine, we'll find the staff. Gold up there. There we go. There's the staff. This is the Cave of the Moon Clan. Meh. staff for like hey we got the staff they want it back and they're like rawr die so then we could have could have just like broken it down ourselves I think <laughs> broken down that gate I mean, it got a nova of death <laughs>
don't like the look of that. Nah, it'll be fine. Do worry too much, Cormac. Active skill category. What did we unlock? Oh, frenzy for the skeletons. Skeleton archers for the mages. Bone armor. Anything else? I think that's it. Twenty-five percent increased attack speed when they attack target. Oh. I'll take it. Bone armor. Hmm. Okay. Reloaded the skeletons, so to speak. Me bone armor. <laughs> ah, that's pretty cool looking. Of course, now we're fighting for corpses with the uh, corpse explosion. Eh, will be okay though. Shouldn't be too big a deal. logs up there. There we go. It kind of hit him. <laughs> courtyard's over that way, okay. I think as we get to the courtyard, I think I'm going to call it a day. <laughs> No. 
Yeah. Is there a checkpoint? Is, is there a waypoint here? I don't think so. Ah, we got a jailer somewhere. Oh, probably the guy glowing yellow. <laughs> There, yep. Frenzy of my minions. There is a new piece to the game. A girl named Leah. My spies tell me she is the child of the witch Adria, who is hiding in the deserts of Chaldeum. Bring this news to the master at once. Ah, it's blocked off there. Hmm. <laughs> Pallid malaise has fallen over the manor we now call home. Young Albrecht seems to be enjoying himself in our new home, however. Perhaps I am simply- He's unstoppable! No mortal could slaughter our brethren with such ease! Then die well! Lord Belial will reward your sacrifice! Easy for you to say. <laughs> Delay him while I prepare his demise in the depths below. to us. Peace will come soon. Have they brought in a new prisoner? Yes, the man with the golden eyes. I saw Magda take him into Leoric's old torture chambers. Below us. I see. Golden eyes? Never noticed that about Tyrael. Sure he's an angel? He's not a gwald. For all you Stargate fans out there. <laughs> ah, there's... That's the waypoint I was thinking of. Yeah. Let's make a uh, trip... Quick trip to town. And, um... I think we'll call it after some inventory management here. Staff. Is that two-handed? Yeah, it's two-handed. Uh, let's see. That has intelligence on it. 
That also has intelligence on it. That was also oh, two-handed mace. <laughs> uh, no wonder. Okay. There we go. I should actually pay attention to that. Mac, what can we give you here? Still don't have an amulet or a uh, Templar relic. In fact, I don't have an amulet either. Good Lord. You know what I'm just about to okay? I don't think... Nah. Wait. Oh, I picked up some gems. Hmm. Cool down, resource. Not really having a problem with either at the moment. <laughs> uh... Other... Intelligence. There we go. One way to get tie broken. Let's see. Keep going for a little while longer. Oh, right there. Convinced that some malevolent being is attempting to wrest control of my thoughts away from me. Voices direct me to horrendous acts, and there are times when I seem unable to control my body. Lazarus knows. This is certain. He looks at me strangely when he thinks me otherwise disposed. Tch. That's because he's calmly in. <laughs> the other one spoilers. <laughs>
the flesh from his bones. Oh, treasure goblin. Don't let him to the portal. There we go. Ooh, a bunch of gems this time. I thought I saw a uh, scroll or a tome or something over there. Plot thing. <laughs> Council begs me to reconsider. I will continue with the executions of those I find guilty of plotting against the kingdom. Perhaps they fear my eye will fall on them and discover their heinous, treasonous plans as well. Lazarus is the only one I can still trust. Yeah, a couple new skills here. I want to attack more often, or do I want cheaper skeletons? I'll attack more often. <laughs> Oops. Bah. Um, is there anything new? Let's see. Just those, okay. Follower. Oh, new skill on the Templar. Um, let's see. Guardian, definitely. That is a lot faster. Yeah, that spike is a lot faster there. Oh, must serve the cycle.
Well, that's not who I was <laughs> expecting them to walk on to, but that works. I do not understand how evil walks in the day. Should it not fear light? You possess only a limited understanding of these forces. But the light is both a literal and figurative foe of evil. I am a Scylla, once queen to our beloved Leoric. My servants are not. One corpse blows up, kills a bunch of guys, makes more corpses. They blow up, kill more guys. <laughs> um, so yeah, I think I'm going to end the stream here and just look that over.